Okay guys, I need you guys to hit that like button. That's going to help me get this video out so more people can watch it. It's going to break the YouTube algorithm so more people will watch my story so they don't have to go through what I'm going through right now. And this is and this is why I'm doing this whole video right now. So people will so people can learn from my mistake, not go through my mistake. Thank you guys by the title of this video you guys should already know you guys should have an idea what went down so I just moved here all the way from Massachusetts to uh, Miami Florida and while I was doing my apartment search I found I came across this beautiful what was beautiful online apartment looks good amenities everything they they said um, the kitchen had had online backlash floors. I thought I was getting down my apartment and everything. Basically, when I got here, I got catfished. And what I did, and I don't want anybody else to do the same, this is why I'm making this video, is do not sign the lease or before you move in or before you look at the apartment. Do not sign the lease before you go through the apartment, check it out and everything. I came down, uh, they, they, I was driving like 1600 miles to Miami, came down on the way here. They said I come move in the, the day I was, I was supposed to be here. So I thought I was getting a nice place, but no, that was not the case. One of the workers at the apartment told me to bring in, bring in the moving costs. So I brought that in and I signed the lease without me physically looking at the apartment. That was the big mistake I made so far. I got my keys and everything. It was ready to go to the apartment and I went to the apartment. The place doesn't look at all what it showed online. When I walked in, there was cockroaches, bugs to the apartment. The cleanliness of the place was very unsanitized and unlivable. My dishwasher didn't even work. It was ripped out. It was a whole disaster, man. Now, see if I can get my money back. They said they won't give me my money back because I already signed the lease and I already got the keys. But I, I haven't even moved into my, the apartment yet. And this is just unbelievable and I don't want anybody else to go through this so please if you are coming from out of state to rent in Miami look at the apartment first before you sign a lease or give them any deposits because these apartment uh, management and apartment places they just try to rip you off I got catfished online it was just unbelievable, man. I can't even explain it. I'm very disappointed with myself, to be honest, because I should have known better to look at the apartment before I signed the lease. I just trusted them so much. Then when I got there, it was just not, it didn't met my expectations of the apartment. It was no, nowhere what the picture showed online because the online was for advertisement purposes that's how they get you in the door and um, I should have known better honestly so that was a big mistake and I, I will take that full responsibility on my end but I don't want anybody else to go and do the same thing so if anybody can learn from my mistakes that would be great you know if I can share the information with somebody else before they make well, they, before they do what I did then that is a big accomplishment you know <clears throat> stay away from Biscayne apartments in general um, they lied about everything uh, the rent over there is very expensive for what you are getting and you could get a better place in a better location with with um, your money
So don't don't, don't trust anything they saying because do not trust anybody over there, you know? I had a bad experience and if you go online and read about their reviews, you will see the same thing. It's a pattern. And they haven't they haven't done nothing to fix it. And me looking at those reviews, I I should have known better, but you know, you learn from your mistakes, so hopefully I'll get out of this mess. Guys, this is what I'm talking about, right? Check it out. Check it out. I moved in, in here yesterday, pick up the keys, came in here, looked at this place, and there was literally bugs crawling all around. I literally just killed a bunch of them, and um, they're all over here. They're all over here, man. Look at this. Look at that. They're all over there. I don't know if you'll be able to tell. They're all over. They're all over the counter, all over the kitchen cabinets, everywhere. Even the sink. Okay guys, it's day four of here living in Florida and the cockroaches situation is getting pretty serious and annoying right now. And now we're killing like 15 a day right now. It's absolutely crazy. They're coming out of every fucking inch of this fucking apartment, every single corner. I got my boxes here. I'm still waiting for some couple more furniture to show up, but this is my temporary bed. The only thing I'm afraid of right now is when my furniture show up and I start laying them out, out and I'm afraid the cockroaches is gonna sneak in there and they're just gonna make themselves right at home, you know? So that is the situation that I'm in right now. The management of the apartment didn't wanna give me my money because I signed the lease without looking at the apartment. And that's what we have here. Uh, the dishwasher was broken. They gave me a broken dishwasher. They're literally coming out of every freaking single inch over here. From the top of the cabinets, down the floor over here, everywhere. There's cockroaches everywhere here. They even hidden behind the sink. It was a hole in there. They apparently covered it, but there's more holes up there. I don't I don't even know why they cover that if there's more holes. I mean, I had to spend like $200 to clean this entire place up because it had cockroaches, dead cockroaches everywhere. There was spider webs on the f ceiling. Um, this thing right here. Look at that. The guy said this is normal, but to me, they could have cleaned that up before they give it to somebody else for a new apartment. Come on now. And let me sh show you guys. So behind this mirror, right here, there's, there was like three or five cockroaches behind there. I had to spray, uh, spray in there. Then like 10 of them came out and I killed them, but I'm not sure if there's more in there. So hopefully that was it. But like I said, once I have all my furniture in here, it's gonna be very hard for the cockroach situation. And um, I don't know, they didn't wanna give me my money back because I signed the lease. Okay, for those of you guys that think I'm exaggerating, um, I'm gonna show you guys that I'm not the first one who's complaining about this, but I'll show you guys. So if you guys check their reviews, right? This is Biscayne Apartments. Um, they got three stars, 183 um, Google reviews. And let's go check these reviews. If you go in there and check these reviews, you're gonna see that 
most of these reviews are one star and for the five star ones there are the fake ones so like this one right here is a five star but that that that, that is like completely fake and they got like a couple other fake ones in there for from like friends and family probably but I'm not the first one who's complaining about how the sanitization of the building is or the cockroaches situation but you can see this is probably fake um, two stars one star the pattern just keeps going so check it out one star two stars um, look oh right here right here it says looks nice way too many cockroaches for an empty apartment though ball too they don't back down the birds own the pool the trees adjacent to the pool makes the water turn green rented an apartment through airbnb type let's go on their website right now so i'm on their website right now no wonder why they have one thousand dollars off because they can't get people in the building This is all fake guys. This is like, it, the pool does not look like that. Look, over here they advertise that they have a club room. But guess what? The club room, you, you don't even use it. So you have to literally pay to rent it for you to be able to use a club room. Tell me that was a joke, right? Tell me that's a joke, right? Right here, let's go to amenities. Amenities, right? Apparently, I haven't even been to the gym. I didn't even get a tour of this place. Check out this, guys. They say, they claim on their website that they have a club room, right? But I picture myself sitting here in this club room. When I got here, they literally told me, yeah, those are off limits because it's only to be rented like I'm paying the rent and I can't even use these amenities here you know that's bogus it's ab absolutely crap I got catfish on their website look these these are the pictures that's on their website they only took the nice pictures but you know literally got catfish over here Okay guys, just as about I was about to be done adding my video that you guys watching right now, I'm adding in it. There was a cockroach is literally sitting next to my bed where I'm about to go to sleep. And I just literally just killed it. Literally just killed it. Just killed it. And this is the situation that I'm dealing with, so I don't even know if I'm about to sleep here tonight. So I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.